California lawmaker wants to give parents a new tool to protect their children against identity theft. As KPIX 5's Julia Goodrich explains, this is the direct result of a series of reports and blogs by our Consumer Watch team. Yeah, yeah. Consumer Watch has been definitely busy. And, you know, it's bad enough that adults have to worry about identity theft, but plenty of children are victims as well. And now, California could be about to catch up with other states that allow parents to take a special precaution to protect our children. It's the number one tool to prevent crooks from opening fraudulent accounts in your name and takes only minutes to put in place. A credit freeze or security freeze automatically blocks any new application for credit. But as KPIX 5 Consumer Watch reporter and mom Julie Watts discovered, it's only available to people with a credit history. In other words, Hello. adults. Your reports really hit home. Now, in response, Assemblyman Mike Gatto has introduced a bill that would allow parents to freeze their child's credit, something 18 other states currently allow. California has been a little slow to adopt it because change is often a little difficult. Gatto says he got behind it when he realized children are even more vulnerable to ID theft than adults, partly because their credit histories are pristine. We've heard horror stories of children, you know, going off to school or applying for a credit card when they turn 18 and finding out that someone stole their identity. So Neil O'Farrell of the Identity Theft Council says applying for a credit freeze is fairly easy. They each have their own way. Just go to each of the three credit reporting bureaus, Experian, Equifax, and TransUnion, and search for the term freeze. Once you confirm your identity and pay a fee, usually five or ten dollars, your account is frozen and can only be unfrozen with a special password or PIN. What happens if you don't remember your PIN? Uh, it, it gets ugly. A simple process Gatto says parents should be able to do for their kids before ID thieves get their hands on a child's personal information. This is a simple fix that's long overdue. Now, late last year, Equifax began allowing parents in all 50 states to actually freeze their child's credit. Gatto's bill would require all the credit bureaus give parents that option. Now, the first hearings on this measure will take place this spring. I'm Juliette Goodrich, KPIX 5.